this is labeled red and light green. So, logically, that is the wire I'm going to need to disconnect it for the altimeter to free spool. So, found the wire. It's one wire and a connector. I got it jumpered right now so the alternator will work when I start it. I'm going to unplug it and it'll idle higher. I have battery charger I borrowed and battery charger on the battery so I don't run it down. So I'm going to start this up. Let that engine kick down. It's still slightly cold so I want it to kick down to about 900, 800 RPM so we'll give it a minute to do that or we'll just Give it a little tap to help it. I'll give it a second to see if it goes any lower. Alright, that's at the right spot now. I gotta go outside the car, but you can hear the difference. So, idling normally now, air conditioning is off. Pretty much everything's off, I think, except the radio, but either way. So we got the alternator charge, exciter, wire, whatever you want to call it. I'm going to pull it out now, and you'll see you can hear a difference. Okay, so now I have it out. You should have been able to hear the difference. It started idling slightly higher. We're going to take a look at the gauge now. No, the voltmeter is now down at zero because the alternator isn't charging. That'll reduce load on parasitic load on the engine and should give me a little bit better mileage. Now not much, but if you combine that with all the other stuff I'm planning to do, that should get me up to where I want to be.